Hi everyone, my name is Justin Odisho and in this Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial I'm going to show you how to overlay and blend clips together using opacities and blending modes. So I've got a couple clips in my project media bin and the first one I'm going to drag on is my base clip. So that'll go on track one, just a clip of me walking around and talking. The next clip I'm going to drag on, I'll drag it on video track two or three, just make sure my audios and videos don't overlap each other and then I can drag it back down if I want to. Video track two. And this is just of some ambient little waves that I thought were some pretty cool looking waves actually with a nice color. So I wanna actually blend the texture and the motion of those waves with the clip underneath to maybe add to some type of cinematic sequence or abstract effect. So there's a couple things that you can do to start blending these clips together. One is you click on the top clip, the clip that's on top of the one underneath it, and you can lower the opacity of this clip in the effect controls. So right now it's at 100, but if we take it down to 50, we can start to see the other clip show through. However, there's some more advanced ways we can blend these together using blending modes. So if I take this back up to 100, I can actually use blending modes to combine and mix the colors of the two videos together to create our final result. So all the Adobe apps offer the same couple dozen blending modes and these are all based on color codes and color hex combinations but essentially you have your darkening modes like multiply or darken, you have your additive modes like screen, lighten, color dodge, and then you have your combining or mixing modes like overlay and soft light. You can look these up to get a more technical definition of how all the colors are being combined but the more you practice through them and just cycle through them you can get a sense for how the different clips are going to interact with each other on these different modes. So one cool one to add some contrast and mix them together is overlay. So this is what this might look like if the waves were on overlay. And you can see that brings some more contrasted color and you can still see the rippling of the waves right, the over group. the original clip. Another thing to keep in mind is you could still apply any effects that you want onto this video clip before you blend it. So if I wanted to go to Lumetri color on the right and desaturate the waves, so it's not bringing any weird colors in there, I could do that. If I wanted to go to the effects panel and go to video effects and add a Gaussian blur onto it to add more of a blurry overlay or blend, I could do that as well. So you could edit and adjust the clip as much as you want before blending them together. So this is what blending two videos might look like. And then just to help you guys picture it in a use, I'll take this music track, I'll drag it on the very bottom, and this is what it might sound like with some music playing underneath. And all of a sudden you see things get a lot more wavy and abstract and kind of cinematic feeling. So that's how to blend two clips together in Adobe Premiere Pro. If you guys like this video, definitely leave a like on it below and try it out with a couple different clips of your own. If you guys want to check out more Premiere tutorials, check out the playlist on my channel and definitely subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for all new future videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.